Hey, this is Carlos, your BMW Genius. In this video, I'm going to show you how to update your non iDrive 7.0 software. Stay tuned. Okay, so the first thing you want to do is go to www, or in this case, you want to search for BMW USA.com slash updates. And it's going to bring you to this website right here, BMW Updates, Update Software. Next thing you want to do is come down to you find, you want to find Check for Software Updates. Click right there. Then once you find that page, you want to come in and type in your VIN number. So we're going to use, once you put your VIN number in, we're going to go ahead and cheat and cut and paste. So put the VIN number, then you're going to search for updates. And if there's a vehicle, so in this case right here, you see that the sub update is found for this 2016 BMW 2 Series. So now you wanna make sure that you have a, a thumb drive hip handy. You're gonna download the system updates. Okay, so go ahead and search your thumb drive. Once you insert the thumb drive, go ahead and click. Click the download and your download should start. If your download doesn't start, go ahead and right click. We're gonna go ahead and save link as. Then find your thumb drive where you save where you're gonna save your your download to. Then go ahead and hit save. Once you save the software update, go ahead and close out the window. And then we're gonna go to the car. To upgrade, to update your software. So basically, what you're gonna do is you're gonna come, hit menu, then hit select settings. Then once you select settings, you're gonna come down to your find software updates, okay? So once you find your software update, go ahead and click that. Then you're gonna actually, you can see, you can show your current version. So you can see what current, the version that's currently installed on your vehicle. Um, then you can come down here to select software update or update software. Then next you're gonna go ahead and install your software. So it's to tell you turn ignition on, the system unavailable during installation, switch the vehicle off when finished. So go ahead and select okay. Now your software installation is gonna go ahead and uh, your update is gonna go ahead and go ahead and be installed. You can see that your software is up, updated software do not move the vehicle until your update has been completed. So once your update is completed, we should get a message here shortly saying updated installation was successful or installation was unsuccessful. So if it's unsuccessful, then again, we're just gonna go ahead and repeat those steps. Huh, now you can see that your software update has been successful. Now you can go ahead and switch the engine off. We're gonna, we're gonna go shut off the engine right now. Um, now we're gonna wait until the display turns off, but you don't have to wait until the display turns off. What you can do is just go ahead and exit the vehicle, lock it, and then you're done. Simple as that. Now. We, we're going to verify your software installation. Okay, so go ahead and turn the vehicle back on. We're going to go ahead and confirm that. Come back down to your um, software updates. And we're going to show current version. Here you can see that the current version is now installed on your vehicle. So, hey, congratulations. You have now just updated your software in your non-iDrive 7.0 BMWs. Hey, just like that, you've updated your system software and your BMW um, in a quick and few easy steps. You're on your way to becoming a pro like me. Um, if you like this video, please like, give us a like or a thumbs up, and be sure to subscribe. New videos are coming every week, so stay tuned for helpful tips and tricks on your older and your new model BMWs. Hey, thanks a lot. Thanks for watching. We'll see you again. Bye for now.